everybody. Happy Monday. So yeah, I just got my clothes on. Um, I just have my sweats and my t-shirt on and my tennis shoes. And I kind of want to go to Hobby Lobby and get just sort of like some kind of a mirror, a mirror panel type of thing to put in that nook right there. Wait, no, that's not the nook. Nope. There's a nook right on the other side of this clock right there that leads down to my basement, but there's like this little hallway nook. And I, w I want to just put a mirror in there because I think it'll make that little corner a lot brighter and that little nook just needs something. So I want to go to to the Hobby Lobby and see what they have. I better print out a coupon. I forgot about the coupons. So yeah, oh, my arm hurts. You guys, it is 55 degrees today. What? It's flipping January. And then tomorrow is going to be 57. And it's like the trees, some of them are started, have started to bud. This is going to be bad. This is going to be bad. Um, I know, I usually don't worry about the weather and I'm really not like a crazy worrier about the weather and global events, but I'm just afraid the end of the world is coming. <laughs> really quickly before we go, this is the nook. I want to put a mirror right there of some kind. So I just think it'll just add a little pop of brightness. So that's what we're gonna look for today. So, did you like my video about Tyler? It was so fun. I loved making that video and he made one of me and we just had lots of fun. Um, and now I can't stop talking in my southern accent. But we had lots of fun. And Tyler helped me figure out how to upload a video longer than 15 minutes. So I'm hoping that I can do that today. I uploaded a test video. Let's see. Where should I go? Should I go straight? Okay. I uploaded a test video that was 35 minutes and it worked. It took like an hour and a half, but it worked. But of course I'm not going to be doing 35 minute videos. I don't plan on that. So maybe about a 25 minute video would be an hour. Anyway, I'm excited, so I'm hoping it'll work out. So now I won't be so rushed. Sorry I'm jiggling here, but this road is bumpy. And my little car phone holder is not the best, because obviously you know you just went flying a minute ago. So, yeah, I can do more chit chat in my videos. And right now I'm eating some Welch's fruit snacks. If, oh, for heaven's sakes, they all just fell out into my cup holder. And my cup holder's filthy. So, anyway. It was so nice outside, you guys. You don't even know. I better go. Look at how cute. It's like a door. That is so cute. Oh my gosh. That is so cute. Hi everybody. I'm back. So, Hobby Lobby was a bust. They didn't have anything like I really wanted. Everything was super heavy and that wall is not it's it's not stable enough for a big heavy thing and what they did have that 
was lighter in weight was too small. So I'll try Walmart. I'm going to try Target, Big Lots, something like that. But Hobby Lobby, it's everything's too fancy. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So anyway, on the way home, I ended up going to the Dollar Tree. And I just did a Dollar Tree haul, so go check it out. Good. But tonight, well, not tonight, but I did grab these fried green beans because Tyler loves them, and so Daryl and I love them too. But we haven't tried these. We tried, have you go, have you got a Habit Burger at your house? I can't talk today, I can't. But if you have a Habit Burger by your house or anywhere, they have these green beans, the fried green beans, and they're amazing. And so, I mean, I'm sure these aren't like exactly like that, but I'm excited to try them. And I also got these cheesy garlic breadsticks and we're gonna have um, a Caesar salad tonight for dinner and I thought we could have some breadsticks to go with you know what I mean to kind of spruce it up so hopefully the salad is still good yeah I got it the other day it's the chopped Caesar salad kit and these are so good so yeah, and this is really filling too. Anywho, so that's what we're gonna do for dinner tonight. Yeah. So let me think here. I ended up getting these veggie straws and they are good. They do taste like munchos. One of you told me they taste like munchos and I love munchos. These yellow ones do taste like a muncho. And where can I find munchos? I can't find them anymore. My Walmart doesn't have them. My grocery store doesn't have them. Um, the only place that I've really seen them is in a gas station, you know. But I don't go into gas stations, really. The only time I ever did was when we would go to the cabin. But these are good. I will always get these. I will always get them. And then I also got these. I haven't tried them yet, but I assume they're good because they're puffy. So these are cheddar and sour cream. I'll break into these later. I don't want to open up another bag of chips right now. Here I am showing you my Dollar Tree stuff when I just did a haul. And I also got these. You got to love a, ch a nacho cheese bugle. Anyway, yeah, I got a few other things, but... I'm not gonna bore you with that. You can, you can go to my my haul and watch it. But I did get these banaka strips. Holy crap, you guys, they're amazing. I didn't expect it to be so powerful, and I put a little strip in my mouth, and I was like, Ooh! it. Yeah, these are powerful. They've got menthol or something in them, and it totally cleared out my nasal passage. It was amazing. So these will fit nicely into my purse. Anyway, yeah. Oh, and I wanted to tell you, I finally used my bag. This is my strawberry bag from the Dollar Tree. I keep it in my purse because I always get our mail from the mailbox because ours is like a few houses down and we don't get the mail every single day because we forget or we're lazy or whatever. And so by the time we go and get the mail, there's like a big huge stack and pile and I have to hold it all in my arms. And so I took this out to the mailbox with me and it was amazing. I just put all of my mail in my little bag and took it home. It was awesome. So I'm glad I have this thing. So now all I have to do is put it back in the berry. I'll show you, it's so fast and easy. So here's the berry and you just, Squish it in. I don't really dig the orange color. I wish they could have made the whole thing red or something like that. So it's in there. And then you just pull this little thing. It's one of those 
little buttons or you push the button and then you pull it and then you push the button and you put it back in. So yeah, and then it stays shut. I love it. I just love it. And I'll put it back in my purse. Okay. Okay. When I was at the Dollar Tree, I got one of these garment bags. These ones are the short ones for suits and whatever. These are pretty good, you guys. I mean, they're rather thin, but they do the trick. They keep the dust out. They protect your stuff fairly well. And there's a little zipper. And then it even has a little clear spot where so you can see what's in there. And then there's a hole at the top to put your hanger through. But yeah, I bought one of these. I have one already, but I bought another one because I'm gonna put it in my coat closet to put my wool sweaters in that I have. So I'm gonna do that right now. Okay, so here they are. I have two sweaters in here. One is a black one and one's this tan one. So these were my mom's and yeah. So anyway, let me zip it up. And it's just super easy, you just zip it up. And so I'll just keep this in my coat closet, but they're nice and protected. And I'm gonna put my placards away. I also got these at the Dollar Tree. Um, these ones are different. I mean, they're the same ones, but the last ones I got, see how tight the floss is? Nice and tight. These ones are kind of baggy. I mean, they, they still are okay, but yeah, I, was, I tried to find the ones like this, but I don't know if they make them all saggy now or what, but I use one of these and it, they're still okay, they're fine. Anyway, I like to put them in this. I keep my dental floss and whatever in here. So yeah, I've only got a couple more of those left. You get 60 in here. So I'm just gonna stick them in. I like these little tool boxes or utility boxes. It's from the Dollar Tree. Um, They're convenient. So let's see. I don't even know why I bought these. I got them a long time ago and I don't use them, but I love the little box. I do, I love the little box. So anyway, I can put the rest of these in here. Holy crap. I'm good to go for the dental floss. These are nice to keep in your purse or whatever. And I like these ones too. I almost got another bag of these, but I'm glad I didn't because I've got plenty in here. And I like to keep these in my purse too. And I use both sides. I use the little brush and the pick. Because I have spaces in between my teeth because my teeth aren't tight. And this goes really well in between my teeth that are kind of spaced, especially I have this crown that I have to keep clean and yeah, I like these. So let's see, stick that on there. Yep, and then I just tuck it away into that. Well, my love bug just called and he is on his way home so he's gonna be late so I don't know if we're gonna have dinner or not he's like you just want to fend I'm like well we can do that or you can have Caesar salad and he's like okay so I don't know so in the meantime I thought I would show you the face of the day so today once again I've got my Mary Kay mascara and I've got to get a new one of these. This is running out fast. The True Match Baby Blossom. And I did put my Mary Kay. 
what is it? I think it's called strawberry cream. Yeah. Let me take the lid off. Yeah. I love this color and I actually have a spare. I just, I don't like how these are so skinny though and you know, the brush is so fat because it gets into other colors. So I think I'm going to just take this and put it here and then I never use this. It's like a ginger or whatever. And then this is shy blush and it's kind of like orgasm from NARS, but I really like this strawberry cream. It's, it really does brighten. And then this, they don't make anymore. I forgot what it was called, but it's kind of like this, but oh well. So yeah, I have that blush on today. And my lip gloss. A lot of you commented how you much you liked it and it's metallic rose and it's by Anastasia and it's $16. It's good stuff and it lasts a long time even when you eat and stuff. It's really it's really good. Today for my eyebrows I used my Gimme Brow and this color uh, what color was it? I don't know. It's the light one. It's kind of like a taupe, of course. And then I um, finished it off with a little bit of this old Maybelline Define a Brow. This one's in dark blonde. I loved these and they stopped making them. So I still have some left, so I just used it in a little bit. I also have my underground eyeliner on from Urban Decay. I love it. And today I found my ColourPop. This is called So Quiche. And yeah, I got this probably a year and a half or so ago. And um, I forgot about it. So looks like that. It's kind of like a, a bronzy taupe with purple and gold flecks of sparkle. I don't know. but And you're supposed to just dip your finger in it. That's what they always suggest. So it's just a really nice neutral color. Sorry, I'm all over the place. So I have that on my eyes today. And with the underground. And the underground just goes with everything. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. And then, of course, I have this on the brow bone as a highlighter. And my It Bye Bye Under Eye in light. And then, of course, I'm using my Confidence in a Compact. I'm really digging this. I don't know why it was creasing on me so much earlier. But this last several times I've used it, it hasn't creased at all. And it's just really nice on the skin. It's not drying. I like it. So this is great for winter. So I'm going to keep using it even though it's in the 50s now. So yeah, I think that's all that I used today. So yeah. That was the face of the day, everybody. Okay, so we're having dinner. Let's see. These breadsticks come like a pizza. They're not separated, which is fine. So, see I thought they'd look like that, but they look like that. So basically we're having pizza today, but it'll be good. And I'm gonna put this in, it says 400, so. And here's our salad. I'm gonna put it together. So in this packet, Croutons. Here are the croutons, and they're nice and chopped up. Here's a little pack of pepper, and it's really good. And then they have a good dressing and some Parmesan cheese. Sorry, the lighting is bad. 
And then here is a little dry quinoa. So, and then here's the salad. And these Dollar Tree tongs are good. Go get you some. really good salad. I'm going to take a better bite of these breadsticks and see if I like them. Good, but I've never met a breadstick I didn't like. I'm getting full, guys. I'm getting full. Okay, so good though. those eyes. like it's just you and me kid so welcome to the closet everybody take him to mama oh she just turned around and walked away turn the other way little one and come back come and see me yes your fans want to say hello Oh, good girl. You love it. Yeah, you love it. I don't think Lola's coming. She's on the bed, and it took her a long while to get on the bed. It takes a lot of strength and energy for her to get up on the bed. Half the time, she stands there and waits for me to lift her up because she can't just jump up on the bed. She's too heavy. But we have a chair on the other side of the bed. You've probably seen it, a green folding chair. And she jumps up on that and gets on the bed. But a lot of times she doesn't want to walk around with the chair. She just wants me to get her and pick her up. So I do it for her. Hi, Mama, but you can jump up anywhere. So anywho, um, yeah, I have a longer video today. I really hope I can get it to upload and if you see this video, you know it uploaded. <sighs> I want to show you some new shoes I got last night. Ta-da! These are on sale. Like, they're clearance, you know, against the wall in the Nike outlet shop. The stuff against their wall was on clearance. So, I got these for a really good deal. And they're light as a feather. And I've never had black tennis shoes before, ever. And they're different. I mean, they're kind of like snug up here. They're kind of like a sock. But I'm still going to wear socks with them. I mean, I mean, like this part here, it's not a tongue that 
and then you open the flap it's just all one piece you know what I'm trying to say so it's different but and I wear a seven but in these I had to get a seven and a half because they do run a little snug and small but I like them and I have a pair of my black sweats you know my black sweats these will go really nicely with my black sweats and then the bottom has fluorescent green so yep I'm happy about that and if you fill out the survey on your receipt within a week of purchase you get ten dollars off your next purchase now that is good all right well I'm gonna head off so I don't make this video too much longer but I'll just love ya and thanks for hanging out with me today and also thank you for all your sweet super sweet kind comments you guys are so nice to me I appreciate it so much just the things that you say to me and the compliments you leave me they just warm my heart so much and I appreciate it so much and you guys make me smile and I just love all ya. I just love all y'all. And I'm really touched and I appreciate ya. And I just hope you're all doing well. And I just wanted to say thank you. So, I'll just see you tomorrow. Good. Have a nice sleepy. And we'll see you then. Good night, everybody.